hello guys welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel today um on this video today not to talk too much i will be talking about two kinds of visa and the first one is permanent visa also known as viper visa and investor visa so many people are asking me to speak about investment visa like when you come here and invest how kind of what kind of visa do you hold what kind of um betterment you know waits for you when you invest in brazil so in this video i'll be breaking it down as simple as i can the first one i'm going to talking about is permanent visa what do we mean by permanent visa is a type of visa that allows foreign nationalities all over the world with no limits to any nationality at all to come to brazil brazilian permanent residency viper also known as viper is awarded to persons that are married to brazilian citizens or permanent residents residents of brazil retired persons that are like continuously earning or continuously receiving um, pensions um, it is awarded to um, professors qualified professors or employees researchers scientists and it is also um, awarded to investors you know that come from countries that are free free area so if you're an investor from this kind of country that allows trade that there's no um limitation within each other's country within the two countries then you are uh, you can be awarded a permanent visa in brazil also it is awarded to religious persons if you're a pastor you know you earn well or you have passion for building like another branch of your church in brazil you can be awarded a permanent um a permanent visa viper in brazil so if this is any of the things these are the kind of persons that are qualified of permanent um visa in brazil these kind of visas they 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 although these kind of visas they allow you to stay in brazil work and live in brazil permanently indefinitely but you have to know that they can be reviewed you know they can call you to review your visa you know they want to know if you're following like the rules and regulations of the country so it can be called to review probably in the third year or lesser if you're married to a brazilian citizen student so it can be called to review afterwards you'll be awarded citizenship but if you're not called to review after the four years of permanent visa that you've been awarded you would get citizenship as long as you maintain good relationship with the country and with your own country after holding four years permanent visa in brazil a resident is eligible to apply for citizenship so far you have maintained ties with the country and you have stayed continuously in the country you've been consistent even if you want to leave the country maybe just travel for holiday and come back it's not like you must stay the whole four years you get so you can travel visit the us visit russia visit ukraine the countries that are visa free to brazil you can even go back to your own country have fun a while and come back to brazil just maintain consistency in the staying in the brazil like maintain your consistency in staying in brazil so if you've done all these things you are entitled to apply for citizenship you also need to be tested of your portuguese skill your portuguese skill will be tested there will be an exam where you will sit down and then your portuguese skill will be tested you will get your result that same day after you've written the exam so your portuguese skill will be tested put that in mind that all these things don't come if you do not speak portuguese or if you do not put like perfect your portuguese so when you are in brazil make sure you take portuguese courses make sure you go for classes make sure you interact because you would write an exam it's not act the exam it's not mathematics or anything but you will write an exam so that your portuguese skill can be tested also 
you would be tested on the cultural and history of the country of brazil they want to know how far you've come do you just want our passport and citizenship and going no they want to know do you know the history do you know their colonization history do you know why the um portuguese people colonized them do you know their um their anthem do you know their pledge do you know the color of their flags do you know what the stars in their flag means so all these little little details you would need to learn them they want to know so they will test you on their culture and history although you can get the citizenship hmm? less than four years you know i've been saying four years since that um a person that um all these people that uh, awarded permanent res permanent visa there's a difference between permanent residency visa and permanent visa so people that are awarded permanent visa you know if you can your yours can be reduced you, you might not have to wait in four years to get citizenship if you are married to a brazilian citizen brazilian citizen not permanent resident do you understand a permanent visa is awarded to a person that is married to a Brazilian citizen or a permanent resident of Brazil. But it could be lesser. You might not have to wait for four years to get citizenship if you are married to a Brazilian citizen, not a permanent resident of Brazil. There are two different categories of people. So you do not mix them up. So permanent residency visa and permanent visa, Viper, they are two different things that you mustn't mix up. As I have said earlier, they are for specified types of people, people that are married to their ladies here, yeah? Brazilian citizen and permanent resident, people that are pastors, people that are investors, professors, researchers, scientists, people that are retired and are still receiving pension. Those are the kind of people that they award permanent visa to so uh, in the next videos i'll be telling you guys about the investment visa i am making this video specifically because someone has been asking me about investment visa probably they want to come and invest in brazil so they can enjoy this opportunity so in the next video i'll be telling you how you can enjoy in this same video rather i'll be telling you how you can enjoy this opportunity of having citizenship through investment so come along with me let's get right into it an investment visa also called investor visa so this type of visas they are awarded to foreign nationals that intend to make investments in brazil so you have plans to make investment you want to come to brazil you want to build an investment here you want to establish one investment here you are you can be awarded the permanent visa not permanent residence i've said earlier you are awarded a permanent visa which allows you stay indefinitely in brazil but after the fourth year you can apply for citizenship so this is what the permanent visa does for an investor that came here to invest in brazil this type of this um this form of investment it does not have a specific type of investment you could come here and build a school you could come here and own a business build and like a, an empire of business it doesn't even have to be an empire you know you can build and install a business here it could be air business it could be um um it could be clothing it could be something there is no specific um type of business or investment it could be real estate it could be it could be technology it could be anything just have an investment here for you to be awarded the permanent visa what are the amounts the amounts that you need that is required by the ministry of labor as an individual is um 500 000 reais when i checked the um trade market it was about 97 thousand dollars and 40 million naira <laughs> so if you have it you earn that much investment in brazil is a good choice for you it's a smart choice for citizenship for you and your family and the good thing about this type of visa is that it extends to your dependents your spouse your children even your parents that is amazing so your children just make sure that during your time of investment your children are not 
over 24 years old as i have been screaming in my other videos types of visa like this that extend to children you must make sure that your children do not get more than 24 year old before you bring them to brazil so that this permanent residency can extend to your dependents your spouse there's no age limit obviously but your children there's an age limit of 24 years old that this um, um visa can extend to them this permanent visa opportunity to stay indefinitely in brazil and work and live without troubles they have to be under 24 years old so um um in the brazilian law you are not limited all you need to provide is a bank account in brazil transfer some fund into it make a business plan and submit all these documents to the ministry of labor in brazil after it has been approved you will be immediately awarded a permanent visa to come and live in brazil with your family so if you are an investor and you are looking for citizenship afterwards after you've been awarded permanent visa sorry excuse me there's fire somewhere so that sound <sighs> There's a lot of fire so that's the firefighters so they make a lot of money when they pass it. so back to the story uh-huh so after you've been awarded permanent visa with your family when you get here after four years you would be able all of you would be able to um uh, apply for citizenship as i have said earlier you'll be tested your skills your portuguese skill will be tested your cultural and history skills on brazil would also be tested so if you're an investor if you're looking for an opportunity to get citizenship of a country that offers so much for less that has a very strong passport that can enter 171 countries if you're looking for such citizenship make sure that you invest or start your plan start to plan investment in brazil make sure that also when you are given this permanent visa to come to brazil make sure that you stay in the country consistently because if you don't stay they would they might withdraw it consistently like you can stay a month enter go out travel to another country come the way i've said it earlier in the other visa in the permanent visa so i'm just talking about this section the investment visa it is also on that permanent visa it's just this category i'm talking about an investor that wants to come and invest in brazil as i have said earlier you don't need a specific kind of investment it can be anything you can have 40 million and come and invest it in real estate here you can have 40 million and then come and build a big international school here employ people you can have a business that you are employing up to 10 brazilians even if it's a small business like you come here and you have a store like this selling african things you can decide to employ 10 brazilians you are getting permanent visa but that small business you already have to be here but the other investment you would obviously need to make your plans and your proof of fund the money inside the brazilian account and submit all these things to the ministry of labor
that's all for today i hope i've been able to help you guys i hope i've been able to educate you guys on investment visa which is which falls under the categories of permanent visa i hope that i see you soon i hope that your investment works and i hope that you do well when you come to brazil see you guys very soon on my next video ciao